So welcome or welcome back to Wired Gaming for week two of our Dishong Tower survival run. And we are on the fourth floor now of Dishong Tower. So we've not got too far to go, I suppose. And we wander around collecting loads of crap. I've cleared out the third floor. I've pretty much removed everything that wasn't useful. All of the wood. Anything that I could get my hands on. Because at the moment, I'm struggling. I can't even build enough spike traps for the base. It's, it's getting rough. Uh, we're only on week two, so it's only going to get harder. But it's okay, because, you know, we, we've got this. We've got this. Lots of zombies. The further up we go, the better stuff we're going to get. I tried to make a forge as well, so I could create something to get clean water in. But, unfortunately, I've not got high enough skill level. I need to find another book so we can actually create a forge. It's going to be tough. I don't know if we're actually going to survive much longer. But we're going to try. We're going to try. I'm hoping we can find the magazine that I need. Yes! Please. Right, sweet. Now we should be able to craft a forge. Let me just double check that. Is it going to let me do it? There, forge. Oh, no. We need to get to level five. Okay, so we need two more of those books. Yeah, we might not get there. It's fine. It is what it is. We, we got this. It's Everything's okay. But... We're still on 10 minute days, so it won't be long until the horde gets here. I'm hoping we can come across something before then, because I need water. I've got no water left. We're going to die of thirst. We're infected. We've got a dodgy knee. Obviously, the more enemies I'm hitting here, the more this arm timer is going up. It's only going up by two seconds every time, but if we get a big group, then it's just causing more and more problems. I've put a few upgrades up as well. We've upgraded stamina, um, a couple of other bits. Mainly the stuff for clubs, early game stuff, really. Oh, shit, there's one behind me. No wonder I'm getting bat- Ah, oh, bollocks. That would be why I'm getting battered, ladies and gentlemen. Overall, though, we're having fun. Um, I'm, I'm really enjoying it. I've not played for a couple of months, and I come on the other day, and it- I, I set it to two hours just so I could clear out the third floor of wood. And I got absolutely nothing useful. We managed to get enough wood together to to upgrade everything and make sure it's all the top end of wood. And I put two more spike traps down. But I don't think we've got enough wood to get any more spike traps out now. So we're a little bit screwed. I've managed to build a staircase as well and opened up these doors. So we can uh, loot a little bit quicker. Obviously, it's 10 minute days, so time runs out pretty damn quickly. I'm hoping we can get all the way through with no major issues on the fourth floor. Now we've upgraded uh, health there by dying. It's it, it wasn't it wasn't an accident. That was planned. It's a tactical death that one. I'm still really annoyed by the lighting. Drives me insane that everything's so dark. But why is it so dark? It never used to be. I'm hoping we can get up to the fifth floor, maybe even the sixth today. So, rather than destroying everything, what we're going to do is sprint through, try and kill as many of the zombies as we can, search for bags and crates and stuff like that. But I'm not going to bother destroying any of the uh, materials, I think. We'll leave that. I can do that after the horde. Come on, you fool. Come on. Give me something good. Give me something good. Can of soup, that's alright. I'll take that at the minute. Food is, um, is tough. We've got nothing. The only food we have got is meat. But... It's a pain in the ass because if I use that meat, then I end up losing water, which I can't afford to do at the minute. Yes! You used to be able to get on top of the vents down here, I'm sure. There was always some pretty good stuff on them. Just bags and boxes and ammo and stuff. We've got a little bit of ammo, nothing massive. It's enough to get us through. Where's that taking me, then?
That's going to be another dead end, isn't it? Yeah. No! My armor's weak as well. No, 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 don't get stuck, don't get stuck. Come on, come on, come on, you fool. Yes, right, down. I think that's all of them. You're getting stuck on the bloody, um, the glass bits. It's really annoying. That was one there. I'm going to sneak in and get him if we can. No! How did he even spot me? I'm finding a lot of cement, but I need loads of cobblestone. If we can get a load of cobblestone, we can upgrade the base a little bit more, and then I don't think we'll really have any problems for the next couple of days. Well, next couple of hordes. Because to be honest, they didn't get too close on the first night. There wasn't that many there. I think having it set to 10 minute days makes the horde harder as well. I didn't know that. I thought it would make the horde easier. Right, there's nothing good, is there, really? Lots of zombies. That's about it. He just disappeared. What the hell? That has never happened to me before. I've never had a zombie just disappear. I can still hear him, though. He must have fallen through the floor. <laughs> well, that's fine by me. Oh, yes. That's the mother load right there. Oh, no, that was him making the noise. He's halfway in the floor as well. What the hell? I've never had them disappear into the floor before. Oh! Guns. Ammo. No guns, just ammo. Lots of ammo. Uh, a little bit of food. Oh, shit. Nothing massively useful. Ammo's always good, don't get me wrong. I'm not ungrateful for my ammo. I love my ammo, but it's just not enough. Come on, anything. I need a cooking pot. I'm just desperate for a cooking pot. Oh, the elevator. Oh, what? There's nothing in it. I thought there'd be stuff in it. Oh, that's disappointing. It's all right. We've only got about ten more floors to go. We'll be we'll be fine. We'll find some good shit somewhere. Although we need to find better stuff before we get to the roof, because if we get to the roof and we haven't got any decent weapons, oh, yeah, that's not going to be fun. That's going to be a tough ride. Right, seeing as though that went well, let's go up to the next floor when we can find the stairs. This thing is such a maze. Some of the floors are such a pain in the ass to get through. Aha, stairs. What is that? Is that iron? Oh, paper and sand. Sweet, so we've got a couple of little bits that are going to do us alright when it comes to health. Uh, water, sorry. I almost just walked straight across there without even looking. Nice, that's it. All those stairs are good. Yoga. Oh no, this is the swimming pool one. This is the gym room. There is nothing good up here. From what I can remember anyway.
Mate, we just smashed them. That was good. There's nothing else up here, though. Speakers. Where's that? Oh, 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 there is a lot in that room. What the hell? Why are they just dying randomly? I am so confused. Working stiff box. Oh, yes, please. Come on, come on, come on. Fingers crossed. Ah. Oh well. Cobblestone's good. We always need cobblestone. Like I say, if we can get the base upgraded just a touch, everything will be fine. Oh, that's going to be a right pain in the ass to break through. Aha! We are through. And I have a sneaky idea, which might work. Just to speed the process up of getting through this window just a tad. If I don't kill everyone. Oh no, you're going the wrong way. I don't want you to go that way. I want you to come here. Yes. That's it. Why did he just drop dead? What the hell, man? There we go. That's better. Give us a hand, fella. Love it. I was hoping they'd all come here so I could knock the wall down as well, but... Obviously not. I hate jumping when I'm being chased by zombies. I always mess it up and end up like knocking myself over or... Oh, oh, there's a... Is that a bloke? Oh, no, it's not. It's a lumberjack. What's there a lum... Why is there a lumberjack in here? What's he doing? Jesus, this guy is tough. Oh. Lumberjacks are easy. I don't mind the lumberjacks. As long as they're not running, they're easy. As soon as they start running, that's when we've got a little bit of a problem. Like, this one is about to sprint, I think. Nope. Nice. Got him. Well, I don't know where the hell the woman went. She literally ran in there. Oh, she meant she dropped dead as well. Why do they keep dropping dead? That's really weird. Or maybe it's because I hit him with my arrow and for some reason it's not registering quickly. Oh. Can we get a toilet pistol today? Toilet pistol, toilet pistol, toilet pistol. Ah. Oh. Right, that's the pool. I don't want to go in there yet. Oh, we could get... Yes. We've got a water source. Get in. That's going to be helpful. I didn't even think about that. <gasps> yes. Oh, we've got no jukes. Bollocks. You can't sell to these either, can you? I don't think. No. Can you? I don't know. No, you can't. I thought you could sell to them. Uh, but 120 for water. So the more jukes we find, the happier of a man I'm going to be. That's going to help us out a hell of a lot. I completely forgot about the swimming pool. Toilet pistol, toilet pistol, toilet. Ah. Oh. Just the toilet pistols are just not what they used to be. They're just never there anymore. There's doors out of the way. And swimming pool. I should really shut all the doors behind me. I think that'd help a little bit if we get attacked by a big group of them. Oh, dude. We got a bloater. We can get him to come down to the shallow end again, uh, deep end again. We can keep him stuck in there. Can they jump in there? No, they can't. Cool. Come on, give me a bag. Give me a bag. My stamina is so slow. Oh, it's night time. Ah, oh, dude. The further up we get, the more worried I'm getting because we are getting nothing useful. No! You couldn't do that a minute ago. Why now? 
I've got no torch. It's a good job I can see their eyes, because I wouldn't be able to bloody get them if I couldn't. Oh, health is bad. Alright, a couple of jukes. Oh, that's a jump. Oh. Actually, no, you won't fall through there, surely not. Why can't I get out? Oh, the blind's in the way, I think. Maybe. That's all going to drop, isn't it? Oh, no. Ooh. Oh. It just takes us back outside to the, uh, the stairs. Really? Nothing. Not even a little treat. Right, we are now on the sixth floor. It's day 11. This is all businessy and smart and posh and shit. Ah, this is the restaurant. Yes, we might get some co some cooking stuff. Come on. And if we get enough jukes, we can stop by the uh, the vending machine on the way back down. I feel like there's going to be something behind this wall. Oh, the floor's just going to fall through. Okay. Oh, we're getting so many vehicle books which are useless to us. Ah, ha, ha, you fell, bitch. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ooh, hoo, hoo. <sighs> that was close. He had eight health left there. Jesus. That was a tough one. Where's the crawler? The ah, the crawler's fallen down there. Haha, <laughs> yeah, bitch. Oh no, that cut. Oh no, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. Right, we need to stop using that pistol because we have no repair kits whatsoever. Boom. So that room was a complete waste of time. Absolutely useless. There was nothing behind the vent, and all we got was a sawn-off mod schematic from the bloody safe. So, pointless endeavour, but onwards and upwards. Maybe some toilet pistols. I doubt it, but maybe. A man can dream. Toilet pistol, toilet pistol. Toilet water. Uh, paper, sorry. He's beating the door down. What are you doing, fool? Hit me, woman. I think this is, like, the shittest run-through I've had so far. I've done Dishong Tower several times, and I don't think the loot has been this dismal before, like, ever. There is nothing. Alright, is that the locked door we just came past? No, it's not. Several. Dude, there's so many. Where are they coming from? Loads of chairs, so we've got a good chunk of wood. 
<laughs> Giggity. Um, which is always useful. That's the kitchen. I just want to see what doors are locked and what are open so we can figure out where the hell we got to go. What's this? Is this like a balcony bit? Oh, no. Right, let's go into the kitchen and see what's in there. I need a cooking pot. That's the... If we come away from this run with a cooking pot, I'm going to be a happy man. That is literally the only thing I'm dying for at the minute. We can cope without anything else. Really? Some brains. Who's serving brains at the restaurant? Oh! Oh, shit, shit, shit. No, no, no. Ooh! No, mate, really? Nothing. There might be something in there. I doubt it, but a man can dream. Where's this zombie gone? Cannot get hit. If we get hit another time, we're dead. Shit. <laughs> uh, boom, we're back up. We're still on day 11 as well, which is nice. Yes. That was a good shot. Come on, come on. Come on, man, we just need a pot. Oh, Why can't you, like, use the pots that are... that you get, like, the meals that are in them? Ah! Right, so there's the elevators. This is Juzo. I thought that was a fully grown tree then for some reason. Oh, mate, we've got to go this way. I don't like going over big old gaps. Where is ev the We are getting nothing. There's barrels. Okay, coffee. Don't need any of that. Right, how many? Who's coming? Okay, just one. Just one. I'm not going to moan at that. That's not bad. I'm even hitting her. I just keep breaking glass over here. I don't have a bandage. Oh, you need ten? Really? Oh, we got one there. Cool. Everything keeps smashing, so somebody's trying to break out of something. Booze bottles. Can we drink any of this? No, we can't. Great. So at least on this run, we've got a lot of stairs. Uh, chairs, sorry. We can take home tons and tons of chairs. To be fair, we got a decent chunk of ammo, actually. I'm, I ain't going to moan about the ammo. Nothing else, though. No, that is it. But we can get upstairs from here. 
Day 12. Okay, we are short on time. Aha, this one is the one that has the good stuff up in the roof, I think. And we could come across our final two points to create a forge. If we do that, we don't even need the books. Normally you come across the pots everywhere. Took his leg clean off, nice. Why is everything locked? Just let a man explore. Let a man find his toilet pistols. Why is that? I should never have asked. Come on, come on, come on. Um, alright, crimps ain't bad. We're going to need them later anyway, if we manage to get some traps up and running. I don't think there's much chance of it at the moment, because we can't fucking get anything that's useful. And we can wear those, I think. Sweet. Ah, yes. We just take 500 off that with a torch. Alright, we just need to make sure we've got a safe escape. I haven't built anything, and it's making me a little bit nervous. Alright, we've got access back to the stairs now, so let's carry on through here. Don't know if we're going to come across anything interesting. Maybe, maybe not. So far, it doesn't look like it, though. That. Oh, it's a bag. I thought it was a pot. I got very, very overexcited there. Oh my days, just die, both of you. It'll be 10 o'clock before I've killed these guys. Yes, one more forge book. I think we just need one more. Yep, just one more and then we've got them all. Um... We don't need seeds, really, at the minute. I tried planting some stuff outside. I don't know if it's going to grow or not. Can we get another one? Just a t-shirt, which... Yeah, no. Well, yeah. I'm sure we could make a bandage out of that. Better than nothing, right? I'm getting very disappointed. I'm very, um, very worried that we're going to die on the next Horde Night. If we die on a Horde Night, it's game over. So I'm hoping we don't.
Uh, I'm gonna hit these guys just until half nine. And then we're gonna have to get something ranged out, because if we die now, I'm fucked. We're not gonna have enough time to come back up, I don't think. And we still need to come back up to get the stuff as well. Right, it's just hit morning time. I hid back, at a load of food, because I saw that guy just as it hit 9 o'clock. So I knew if I went out at 9 o'clock, I would get battered in this room. So I decided just to hold off. So now our health's gone up. Our status effect has gone down, which is great. We should now be all right. I'm hoping we can clear this floor today and just have enough time. Everything should be fine. I'm going to sprint as... Quick as I can through most of it, though. I want to make sure we clean it out completely. Ingots are not bad this early on. Not that we can build anything with them, but they're, they're not bad to have, I suppose. I have a feeling, though, we've just hit the end of this floor. Which is not good. I thought this floor was bigger. Yeah, we've been in there already. Where's the hole we came in from? I guess that's it then for this one. There's nothing else up here that's of use to me. Which is a bit of a shame. Right, so let's go back downstairs then, I think, and just get ready for the horde. Right, whilst we were on the staircase, I just decided to peek in on the next floor up. And oh my god. That is way too many zombies for my liking. I'm going to be battered by these dudes. Uh, fuck it. Come on, come on. And get a couple of hits on. Just before they break through. I just want to get rid of the sprinter. Everyone else is not a threat to me. Oh, they're all sprinters. No, move, move, move. No. Oh, mate. There's a couple of bags up there as well. Bollocks. We're going to have to get back up and grab those bags. Oh. Right, we made it back up. Um, It's almost midnight. A little bit. Shit. Nothing good, really. Never mind. I need a new firearm. If we're going to make it through the next few nights, we need a big boy gun. Or a repair kit. Either one of those will work fine. This floor is quite a tough one, I think. I'm going to come across a lot of running dudes. I'm going to clear out whilst it's light and then come back and do the safes if I come across any more at night time just to avoid the possibility of getting shafted. I say avoid. Avoid it as much as possible anyway. Come on, a forge, forge, forge. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, lots of cupboards. We might find a pot. I doubt it, but we might find a pot. 
A man can dream. No. But when we do, we're going to be able to cook some goddamn good food. It's very quiet. Where are all the zombies? There's only a couple in that little room. Hmm. Well, the shit's lawyers are not doing me any favours right now. Why do you always find paper in the toilet? I understand toilet roll, but... You, you wouldn't be able to take it out. Why do I hear so many? Where are they coming from? Oh, it's lovely and bright in here. Oh, shit. No, no, no. Down, fool. Oh, mate, I'm fatigued. You're joking. Why am I getting hit with so many status effects? Just constantly piling them on. Sweet. Hopefully we can come across another couple of books. Nice! I've suffered a deep laceration. Oh, bollocks. Right, the horde is about to show up. Um, we've got nothing really that's going to help us or save us in in this scenario. Uh, but <laughs> we're going to make do. It's fine. It's fine. We got this. We got this somehow. We haven't got this, not even slightly. Uh, I've also built a new way into the base to remove the door. So hopefully that removes a little bit of the vulnerability away. Might not, but it's better than nothing, right? Oh, no. I wanted to shoot through them. Because this is going to die. I know this is going to die. Yeah, we've built some stairs up onto the roof. So we can climb in now. From the rooftop. Which should be... And so can they. How are they getting in from the rooftop? No. They should not be able to drop in like that. Oh, bollocks. Um... There you go, that'll just block that off for just a second. We'll just deal with what we got for now. I haven't got enough arrows or armor. I haven't got enough of anything, really. Although, if I can... No! I'm done. Dude, what a shitstorm. That was brutal. Definitely didn't put enough time into planning there. I got way too cocky with the uh, with the searching. So now we have... Um, well, yeah, we're done. We've got no ammo. A gun that doesn't work. Shit. I thought it would go better. I'm not going to lie. I, I definitely thought I'd do better than that. Well, either way, we've we've got a nice little home base, which... Yep. 
does not work. Hey, even my bedroll was battered. Why wouldn't it let me stick that on there? There we go. Right, sweet. So our base is... Well, I thought we'd be safe like that. Obviously not. We're going to have to keep that a hell of a lot more open so they can't jump in like that again. I'm pretty sure that's how they got in anyway. Oh, well, we can just use a block to get across when we need to. But for the first night, all we need to do really is just upgrade it a little bit more for the next one. Hopefully that'll work. We'll have to wait and see. But hopefully you've enjoyed today's episode. If you have, you know what to do. Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. Stick around for much more survival content. I've been YG, been awesome. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.